Attorneys typically represent multiple clients in different matters at the same time. If any of those clients have conflicting interests with each other, the attorney may be caught in an ethical dilemma that can lead to disqualification. That's exactly what happened in the case of Cinema 5 versus Cinerama. Manley Fleischman was a partner who split his time working at two firms, one based in Buffalo, New York, and the other in New York City. Cinerama, a large movie distributor, hired the Buffalo firm to defend against antitrust litigation in which local theater operators in upstate New York alleged that Cinerama was illegally restricting access to movies. While that litigation was pending, Cinema 5 hired Fleischmann's New York City firm to sue Cinerama for allegedly conspiring to take over Cinema 5 to create a monopoly in New York City. Cinerama moved to disqualify Fleischmann and the New York City firm from representing Cinema 5 because of Fleischmann's connection to the Buffalo firm that was defending Cinerama in the upstate antitrust litigation. Cinema 5 argued that disqualification wasn't warranted because the upstate antitrust dispute didn't have a substantial relationship to the hostile takeover dispute in New York City. The district court found that the connection between the two firms would hinder future confidential communications between Cinerama and its attorneys. Therefore, to avoid the appearance of impropriety, the district court disqualified Fleischmann and the New York City firm from representing Cinema 5. Cinema 5 appealed to the United States Court of Appeals for the Second Circuit.